Our next honoree graduated from medical school in 1978 and stayed in Loma Linda for a diagnostic radiology internship and residency. From there, he embarked on three years of service in the U.S. Air Force. During his military assignment, he served as Chief of Radiology and Deputy Chief of Hospital Services at the U.S. Air Force Hospital in Ellsworth, South Dakota. He also earned an Air Force Commendation Medal and was promoted to Major prior to honorable discharge in 1985. Then it was off to Harvard Medical School for a fellowship in pediatric radiology. Our honoree subsequently accepted a teaching position at the University of Alabama. He served there for over 30 years, holding leadership positions from co-director of pediatric radiology resident education to clinical professor, radiation safety officer, and medical director of MRI. An expert in his specialty, he has served on numerous steering committees and is an active member of a number of national societies. In 1989, he was awarded special competency in nuclear radiology by the American Board of Radiology. Throughout his career, he has repeatedly earned recognition as an outstanding educator and holds multiple designations as a top doctor, including being named among the best doctors in America in 2017. While this list of accolades could continue, our honoree is perhaps most well known for his exuberant optimism and willingness to help those in need. He resides in Mountain Brook, Alabama with his wife, Madeline. They have two grown children and three grandchildren. And now, from the class of 1978A, please welcome Dr. Daniel W. Young. Good evening, friends. This is my backyard in Mountain Brook, Alabama. I've lived here since 1987. It's been 40 years since I finished my training in Loma Linda, and I want you to know that I value it greatly. I had wonderful instructors, wonderful role models, but the truth is that my specialty, radiology, has changed a lot since I finished. In fact, MRI scanning, for instance, did not exist when I was a resident. A lot of it I had to learn post-residency. And this is true for many things in medicine. You learn the principles, and then you have to constantly add on, modify, perfect as you go along. One of the things that I value the most from Loma Linda is the association with Christian physicians. Uh, it is a great privilege to mix Christianity with medicine. And if I could say anything to all of you, it would be aspire to be the best Christian physician that you can possibly be. That's the highest calling we have. Thank you again for this wonderful honor.